The Houston Astros, however, couldn't care less about winter's nip. They are working out in their new all-weather stadium. Dubbed the eighth wonder of the world, the Astrodome was considered the most advanced stadium of its time when it opened in 1965. People were coming all from all over the world to see the Astrodome. It was that significant. It, it, it's something that's been here and made a significant impact on a lot of people's lives for a long time. I mean, it's, 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 it's a piece of Houston history. But now it sits unused, slowly deteriorating, and could be headed for the wrecking ball. The place where Billie Jean King beat Bobby Riggs in the Battle of the Sexes doesn't even have electricity anymore. The seats are falling apart at the seams. The famous AstroTurf sits crumpled on the floor. There are piles of cardboard boxes and trash, not to mention rusting metal bars. The last time the Astrodome was used for anything of national significance was more than six years ago when Hurricane Katrina refugees filled the stadium's floor. The Astros have long since left to Minute Maid Park and the Texans play in nearby Reliance Stadium. The, the teams really needed to have single purpose buildings to get the revenue streams from the suites and the advertising that they needed to sustain themselves. The questions now surround what to do with the facility. A board will soon have to decide if there's any feasible way to breathe new life into the 47-year-old structure or if it's time to wipe it from the map. Tim McGuire, The Associated Press.